Did you know that you can do this with Adobe Express? We are going to play with generative fill. I want for you to bring a photo. Just bring anything that you have in your phone, in your computer. The idea is for you to just learn while having fun. Let's go to generative fill. I'm going to click in upload. This is the photo that I'm going to be working with. All right, let's restyle this living room. Let's say that we're going to remove this lamp, also this chair. We can do it one by one, or if we're doing the same command, we can do it together with different elements that we want to remove. I want to remove also this frame. I'm gonna type remove and generate. I like this grading animation a lot. It does feel like magic. And now we have some other options here. We can see the finishes on the areas that those elements were removed and evaluate which one looks best. I think I like this third one. I do see a little bit of like element over here like a rest of the frame, but it's fine. I'll take care of this later. Now we are going to upgrade this lamp into a modern ceiling lamp. All right, we have some new options. I'm going to load some more. I do like this one. It has a straight cut. Let's see what we get. Oh, this one's nice. I like this one too with the huge bulb. This one looks closest to a real one because of the lighting and the reflections over here. So I'm gonna go with this one. Now I need to delete this little dirt that is over there because it's driving me crazy. I'm gonna put remove again. We have clean wall now. What about if we upgrade the couch to be maybe a dark green? Let's see. Dark green couch. Okay, that's not dark, but it is green. We're talking. Let's load some more. Okay, this one has a weird fabric over here so crazy that does these things okay i like the shape of this one the color is a little bit bright but i do like the shape i'm gonna go with this one and the other thing that i think that we might be missing is a plant maybe over here I'm gonna add a monster plan. This one is my favorite. I have it at home, of course, and it looks beautiful everywhere. So let's see how it looks here. All right, let's see. Okay, I like this one. And you have no idea how many times I've done this in my house. I spend a lot of time just redoing and getting ideas for decoration with AI. I think it's a really cool feature just to explore all your ideas and make it reality within a couple minutes. Now I want to do another photographer test. Let's go back to the main page and let's upload this one. I want to have a lake over here. Let's see. Give it a little bit of space and add a lake. Wow, this is so crazy how we can change images like this. I do like this one a lot. It has more of a um, 
intense reflection of the mountains. Speaking of mountains, I just want to add more mountains over here. We definitely changed the landscape. These ones are really cool. And what about this sky? Let's increase the size. I'm going to put sunny sky and let's see what it does. All right, we have more of a blue here. It's not white as white anymore. This one is gradient. This one is a little bit more intense. I like this one. I think I'm going to keep this one. And maybe over here, we can add a rainbow. We have a little bit of a rainbow over here. This is too exaggerated. Oh, this one's perfect, actually. Beautiful. So maybe over here, we have the sun. I like this one, actually. It's not the sun, like over here, but it does feel like natural this defuminating of the rainbow over here i'm gonna go with this one i'm andrea marquez and if you want to know more check out my course in domestica.org